Hey guys, what's up? It's AppOSX here, and today I will be showing you guys a new and exciting jailbreak tweak that brings user-like functionality that is found on Windows and Mac OS X, basically any operating system that's on a computer computer, um, it basically brings that, and that is called iUsers. iUsers, as you would expect, does bring user functionality to the iPad. I will be showing you on a freshly restored 4.3.3 iPad just for testing purposes and to make things easier, but let's go ahead and get into iUsers. So iUsers is really cool. So if you lock, if you go to your lock screen, you notice that you do have a new button down here. Tap this button and you're prompted with the select user login, which you're prompted with three usernames. I have guest, iOS UDID, and AppOSX. We're currently on AppOSX, and if we slide to unlock and we type in our password, you can see my icon layout right here. If I zoom back out, we have the default, and then we have Cydia, Twitter, Angry Birds, and uh, Fruit Ninja. And when we open up Twitter, we of course have my Twitter set up right there. There's my app OS X. And if we open up Angry Birds, we do have progress within the game. So we'll just hit cancel, and we'll see how far I am in the game. That is really what the cool part about iUsers is and that'll show you just here in a sec. So as you can see, I'm currently on level three, but if I sign out and let's say um, a guest wants to use the iPad, you tap guest, it'll log the guest in, and it kind of does it in a little bit of a weird way, but it works, kind of like locks the device, respring's, does some sort of combination, but then you are in guest, which I didn't set a password for because usually a guest wouldn't have it, and you already can notice changes. The city icon is in the dock. There are five icons, and when you swipe to the left, Obviously, City isn't up there. And even cooler, if you launch Twitter, you do not have an account set up, unlike the other one where you have, um, you know, App OS X. And if you launch Angry Birds, it does pop up that little screen right there for a sec, which is likely just a bug. But if we get started into the game right here, hit play, and look at that, we have no progress within the game. So iUsers even allows you to have different, I guess, app storage and settings for each profile. If we go to iOS UDID, which this one is an admin and does have a password, so we'll go ahead and log on to that. Go on to iOS UDID, and when we launch up, I have a different password for this one, we're just gonna do 5555. And as you can see, the Twitter icon is in the dock now, and when we launch up Twitter, you are prompted with iOS UDIDs of course, my uh, iOS UDID's Twitter right there in the top left-hand corner and so forth. So iUsers is a really cool tweak that allows you, if you ever find the need to just want to have a guest account or different users, multiple people using an iPad, now you can do it. No one will ruin your game progress. No one will ruin your high scores. And what's best of all is it's even password protectable. So if we go to iUsers, as long as you're an admin, which iOS UDID is because um, I created it, then you can add users and you can add their names. So we'll just do test. We can add passwords. You can do numeric. We'll just do numeric three, four, five, six. And then we can make them an admin or not. Obviously, if you don't want them editing settings, you turn that off. And if you want them to, you can turn that on. We'll just leave it off to show you that. So let's go to the lock screen, lock the device, hit this, go to test. And when we load up test, you can see that the user test, since they're not an admin, is not allowed to edit the preferences. This provides security, and um, so we do uh, 3456, there's the password, and when we go into settings, obviously they cannot add users or edit anything but themselves. So that is basically iUsers. It is a really, really awesome jailbreak tweak. Um, it's free and it's currently on a separate repo that you will need to add. So this repo is on the screen right here and it is also in the description. You need to add this repo because that's the only repo it's on right now. And I encourage you to check this out on your iPad too or any basically an iPad running iOS 4 because it's really a cool jailbreak tweak and I think it could be exciting for some people. Some people might not want it. Just if you have any thoughts, leave that in the comment section below. Go ahead and discuss and give me your thoughts about this tweak. But hey, it's free, so there's no reason why you shouldn't check it out. So that's it for this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe somewhere up there. Follow me on Twitter at AppOSX and iOS UDID. And of course, check out iOSUDID.com for to register your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch with iOS 5 beta. That's it for this video. 
Thanks for watching.